Hi, it's Reviews here. I'm here again with another review, and today is the Adidas Yeezy 380 Calcite Glow. So this is a pair I've actually had for a while, um, and I actually ordered these early off GOAT, which is kind of awkward, and I was going to review it, but I just got caught up so much, and I never did it, so here it is, and I know I am probably really late, um, but yes, here it is, guys. So it says 380 on the top of the box, boost on the sides, and then here to the sides, and you went true to size with my 380s, and it says Calcite, or... Tell something if my camera will focus. Let's have a look. There we go. So it says Cal Glow. So it's a short for Calcite Glow. It was 10, so true to size of these guys. Um, they said to go up half a size, but I personally didn't want to do that with this pair of 380s because I think going up half a size would be way too much. So I suggest maybe not to. But I'll leave that to your discretion if you've ever tried on a pair of 380s. But personally, I find these to be my favorite pair of 380s I have released. They're really cool, and I'll show you why. So inside the box, these do have the bungee lacing, so you do get the extra lacing inside the box, which I think I'll swap out eventually, but you get your normal rope lacing, which I personally actually like. But these are more convenient, um, really easy to pop on, um, in comparison to, say, for instance, you know, lacing the shoes, depending if you're lazy like me. <laughs> now, so inside, the actual shoes, and the box from GOAT, of course, you get the GOAT sticker, um, you get the authenticity check here, which is nice to have, and you get your standard tag tags. So, nothing too exciting or new. Just close that up, the box, get ready for it. There we go. It was a little one, not too bad as others. So here are the pair of shoes themselves. Um, Straight out of the box, they're very, very nice. On camera, they're probably coming out more white, but they have this really nice kind of threading here, this nice threading of some sort. I don't know if you'd call it like a prime knit or knitting. It's probably, yeah, it's a knit, but these are like more of a minty color. They're actually like kind of bubbles across here, like a mint. And this part here is this very, very light brown, a mixture of light brown and gray. But it's really cool because the whole entire shoe glows in the dark, and that's why it's called Calcite Glow. And that's what's really unique about these, and that's why I really love them. The outsole itself is slightly dirty, but you can see pretty much after wear, that's actually what's going to become, or well, that's how it's actually going to get dirty. The boost doesn't get as dirty, depending on where you're walking, of course, um, but mainly just the actual outsole here, which has this really unique, organic kind of shape to it. And it also does have the Adidas logo right there, but it doesn't say Adidas, it just has the three stripes, which is really nice, very minimal. Really, really cool. Inside, the actual shoe says, it says Yeezy, and then Adidas as well. And the insole itself, that there is just a white color. So it's really nice, um, standard white lacing. But yeah, it's really covered with all this mint accents. I don't think you can really see it correctly with my light. It's probably a bit too bright. But if turning that on, not turning that off, mm, you can't really see it as well still. But it's this really nice minty color. And when I chuck these on feet, you probably definitely will see. But overall, I think they're just really, really nice. I really like the accents on this pair of shoes. Um, really nice. Are they more comfortable? Yeah, to a degree. Um, this midsole here really lifts you off the ground a little bit more. I definitely feel that. And you can even see the boost running through the midsole here. It's actually peeking through, um, which is really cool. But I don't know if these are more comfortable. To a degree, they are a little bit more supportive because the heel is raised. So I actually find that actually nicer. And they're more comfortable to wear because of that. But I don't know if they're more comfortable, if that makes sense. But I probably could wear these for a longer period of time rather than 350s. Um, but yeah, I'd personally go true to size. You probably could go up half a size if you have flat foot or wider foot. But I just personally stuck to my true size. And that is with the insoles still in, not with the insoles out. So yeah, I don't have a problem with these whatsoever being true to size. But either way, enough of me talking. I'll show you some of that glow feature. So how that works is it's got a little bit of... A light here, UV light, or black light. Just to show you roughly, so we'll turn off the light here. But you, you can see slightly it's glowing a little bit. There you go. So you can see the glow much better with the light off. But I'll show you completely in the dark as well. I'll show you after I do the on feet, I'll show you how that looks. But that's how it glows. It's really cool when you go to a party and your shoes just glowing. It's just awesome. I find it really cool. And even the knit, the knit itself glows, which is something I've personally never seen before in a shoe. Um, you can see it slightly, very hard to see on camera, but I'll show you guys after I do the on feet, let's get the on feet on first, and yeah, then I'll show you how this really glows, and it's awesome, awesome pair of 380s, it's currently un under retail on 
um, goat. I paid like $500, it's now like less than $300, so I got stooged. Um, but yeah, let's get into that really quickly. Um, also, the size tag there is at the top of the tongue. And that's, let's see if it'll focus on that for me. Yep, that's how that looks there. But yeah, it's pretty much, it's all one knit. It's no, there's no separate tongue, so it is a really tight fit and it's hard to get your foot on there. It's really hard to squeeze through this hole there. But you get used to it eventually and you just have to stretch out a lot to actually get your foot in, which is funny as. And all this side here is perforation, so whatever socks you're wearing as well can slightly change the color of that part of the shoe. But yeah, it's really cool. Let's get the on feet on first though, guys. Sorry about that. Um, and yeah, let me know what you think of these in the comment section down below. I really hope you guys enjoyed that on feet portion of the video and you can probably see how that my black socks could actually bleed through this part of the mesh um, and that's really cool about these this this is all perforations so you can see right through it it's all perforation so customizing the lacing you I don't think you really can do that through these parts here um, <laughs> probably do it through that part there and any other hole but yeah it's actually all perforated so breathability is really nice um, but yeah, your socks can change the color of the shoe, which is really unique. Um, but yeah, I'll quickly show you now how this looks in the dark with it glowing up. Let's get into that. Overall, everyone, I really hope you enjoyed this review today and on feet. Um, if you did enjoy it, please give it a good thumbs up. I do appreciate it a lot and it gives me knowledge that you like my content. Um, and please leave your comments down below if you cop these or if you actually decide to get them off Goat because they're actually really cheap at the moment. So I definitely suggest if you're looking at your first pair of 380s and this is my first pair of 380s. So really nice, versatile color. I really, really like it. The really nice mint accents really do it for me. I love the color of it so much. Um, yeah, but let me know down below in the comment section if you like these at all. Um, yeah, and I hope to hear from all of you. Please subscribe stay tuned for more doing 1000 subscriber giveaway so stay tuned for that and i hope to see you all on the next review